keep that chin tucked down. Let's work on a nice bounce as well. So really get that bounce going. Let's right away move that head. So as I'm throwing these ones and twos, let's move our head from one side to the other, making sure we're keeping it nice and loose, nice and relaxed. Yep. Good. Keep working those movements with your head. Remember to keep the elbows in, keep that chin tucked down. Good. Let's mix in as well some rolling, some, some dips, right? So as I'm doing these ones and twos, I'm moving my head. I'm also working on kind of rolling from one side to the other. Good. Remember, keep that good rotation. Get those hands to turn over. Nice. <clears throat> Let's mix in the long shots as well from the uppercuts. So we got the ones and twos. Let's also throw some fives and sixes from far away. So again, I want distance. What's up, Leslie? Thank you for being here. So I'm working on long punches, keeping it nice and relaxed. So I have the fives and sixes, I have the ones and twos, making sure I'm getting good rotation. Remember to keep that chin tucked down. Yep. Nice. Good rhythm. Very, very good. Three, two, one. Very nice. Keep those hands nice and high. Let's just work on nice, one nice clean lead hook. So give me a good rotation. Remember, hitting the flat bag. Still hit the center of the bag. Doesn't matter the shape of your bag. Let's go for the center each time. Make sure we're here with those two big knuckles. Let's get a nice, let's really loop it around this time. So let's get that nice rotation when I'm shooting that punch in the bag. Good. Good. So we're going to go for that, that lead hook. And then we're going to go for that rear hook. Let's keep it nice and clean. So lead hook, rear hook. Let's go far away from the bag. Notice I'm getting nice range. That's it. Let's go for two more. One more time. Very nice. Let's add to that. So I'm going to go push, push, hook, hook. I'm going to go push, lead uppercut push, and then rear uppercut. So three, four, five, six. Just like that. Three, four, five, six. Three, four, five, six. Yep. Six. Let's go for two more. Ah, one more time. Push. Very nice. Let's work that jab again. Remember to really shoot it out. Go as long as you can. So really try and extend. Extend pretty long. Make sure you're not getting too close to the bag. I want you to really use that range when you're shooting that jab. Good. So we're shooting that, huh, that jab, push, and I'm going to go for that rear uppercut. So it's a one, and then we go right into that number six. So one six. Good. That's it. Let's go for two more. Huh, one more time. Good. Let's go one, six, and then a three. So one, six, three. So we'll shoot the one, we'll shoot the, push, the six. And then we'll shoot the three. One, six, three. That's it. Let's go for two more. One more time. Very nice. From a distance here, let's go for that one, two, one, two. Let's slip to the rear side. Ha! And then come back with another number two. So one, two, one, two. We'll slip. And come back with a two. That's it. One, two, slip, ha, fire that two. One, two, one, two, slip, push, fire that two. Good. Push, push, good. Push, one more time. Push, push, yeah, nice. Let's go for that lead hook again. Push, push, push. Get that elbow push, pretty high. So make sure 
you're really committing to ah, getting that elbow up and then bringing it back down. So elbow high and then bring it back down. Get a nice, nice, push, clean lead hook. Push, push. Let's go for two more. Push. One more time. Push. Very nice. Let's get close to the bag. Let's go for four uppercuts. So we'll do five, six, five, six. Five, six, five, six. Notice I'm uh -huh, kind of still bouncing on my toes. So think of really bah, 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 bah. use that bounce with your toes to get that ah, quick punches. Five, six, five, six. Good. That's it. Let's go for two more. One more time. Very good. Five, six, five, six. And let's stick a really hard lead hook. So five, six, five, six. And then a powerful number three. So five, six, five, six. Whoosh, and then a big three. Whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. Good. Two more. Whoosh. One more time. Whoosh. Good. Nice. Let's finish that with a cross. So five, six, five, six, a three, and then a number two. So five, six, five, six. Pa, 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 pa. Whoosh, a hard hook. Whoosh, and then a hard cross. Whoosh, whoosh. Whoosh, whoosh. Let's go for two more. Push. One more time. Push, push. Yeah, nice work. Good. Let's shoot that jab again. Ha! From far away. Push. Push. Ha! Push. Push. That's it. Ha! Ha! Good. That one, two. Push, push. Ha, ha. Good. Push, push. Two more. Ha, ha! One more time. Ha! Very good. From far away here, let's do for that five, six, five, six. So we're going to reach for these four hooks now before we're close. Now we're going to be far away. So let's go five, six, five, six. Notice I'm reaching. I'm still keeping good form. So I still want to protect my face. I'm throwing from far away, but I'm making sure I'm keeping good, good guard. So five, six, five, six. Keep it nice and high. Push. Go for two more. Ha, one more time. Hush, very good. Let's shoot the jab again. Ha. Push, push, push. Notice I'm ha. Push, really working on that sharp jab, moving my feet, bending my knees as I push, fire that punch. Push, 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 push. That's it. Push. Good. One more time. Good. Nice work from a distance. Let's go one, two. Let's slip to the rear side. Throw that cross and let's go for that that lead uppercut. So it'll be a one, two. We'll slip to the rear side. Give me a two and let's go for that number five. So one, two, slip. One, two, slip. Two, five. One, two, slip. Two, five. Good. One, two, slip, two, five. That's it. One, two, slip, two, five. Good. One, two, slip, two, five. One more time. One, two, slip, two, five. Very good. Let's add a lead hook after that. So one, two, slip, two, five, and then a number three. So one, two, slip, two, five, and then a three. One, two, slip, two, five, three. One, two, slip, two, five, three. Two more. One, two, slip. Two, five, three. One more time. One, two, slip. Two, five, three. Very good. From a distance again, let's go one, two, one, two. Good. Move that head. Ha, let's go two more. One more time. Ish, very good. Let's get to that homework assignment. Shout out, Leslie. Thank you for always being on point. <laughs> um, so with the homework assignment today, Let's start again. Let's start again with a one, two, and then we'll add to the combination. So again, from far away from your bag, let's go for just a just nice, clean one, two. Take your time here. Get a nice rotation. Really focus uh, for this one on the cross. I want that back foot to really give me a nice pivot. All right. So we shoot the one and then ah, I want to really dig in and commit to that number two. So give me a good pivot on that back foot. So again, one, two. Notice I'm looking for whoosh, good rotation. Ha! Ha! That's it. Whoosh, whoosh. Whoosh, whoosh. Good hip rotation. One, two. Good. One, 
one, two. Let's go for two more. Push. One more time. Push. Yes, good. I love it. Keep it nice and long. Let's add to that. So nice and long. One, two, and then we'll go into that five, but the five is far away. So it's one, two, good rotation. Push. And then a really long number five, that lead uppercut from far away. So one, two, push, five. Try not to get too close to the bag. Your natural reaction may be to get closer, just to make it easier on your shoulders, but I want you to be far away. So one, two, five, all at a distance. One, two, five. That's it. One more time. Good. I like where we're at here. Let's add a slip to the rear side and come back with another number two. So it'll be one, two, five. We're going to slip and then come with a two. We're going to change up the combo today. So from far away, one, two, five, slip to the rear side, come with that two. So one, two, five, slip, two. One, two, five, slip, two. Again. Notice again, I'm looking for be far away from your bag. So really give me good range, good distance. One, two, five, slip, two. That's it. Good. Two more. One more time. Yeah, nice, nice. We're going to add to that one. So we've got one, two, five, slip, two, three, two. So adding a lead hook and a cross at the end. So it's one, two, five, slip, two, three, two. And again, far away, so really reach for that bag. So one, two, five, slip, two, three, two. One, two, five, slip, two, three, two. Again, one, two, five, slip, two, three, two. Good. One, two, five, slip, two, three, two. One more time. One, two, five, slip, two, three, two, double jab cross. And that's how we'll finish the combination. So one, two, five, slip, two, three, two, one, two, let's do, you know what? One, two, one, two. Yeah, one, two, one, two. Let's uh, one, two, one, two. Let's do four punches at the end. So really kind of cap that thing off. One, two, five, slip, two, three, two, one, two, one, two. Yeah, I like that. So one, two, five, slip, two, three, two, one, two, one, two. One, two, five, slip, two, three, two, one, two, one, two. A few more. One, two, five, slip, two, three, two, one, two, one, two. Let's go one more. Yeah, nice. I like that a lot. Let's switch our stance. Let's just throw a jab. So let's go for that. One from the opposite side, a stance. Notice, I want you to again play with this, play with the head movement, really shoot the jab from far away, bend the knees, move your head, keep working. You guys are doing awesome. Yes, yes, yes. This is looking really nice. Again, we're in the opposite stance. We're shooting the jab, we're playing with it. So if you're right handed, you're lefty. If you're lefty, you're righty. Just gonna play that up. Keep the both hands up. Let's add the cross. Give me good rotation. This just like we did in other stance. Give me good rotation on that back foot. Fire it from far far away. Good. That's it. Let's go for two more. One more time. Yeah, nice. Let's switch it back to our normal stance. Let's go double jab. And let's shoot a cross down low. This would be good practice. If you have a heavy bag, this would make sense. Uh, with the quiet punch, obviously, just for the head shots. But we're going to actually work on squatting pretty deep. So we'll double jab. Let's squat down and then shoot it. Make sure you're actually squatting. I don't want you to bend over. It should come from your legs, not your back. So double jab, squat, and fire that cross. So it's 1-1. One, one. And this will be like a number 10 if you do the number system that uh, straight to the body. So on one, and then fire that 10. That's it. Let's go two more. 
One more time. Yeah, nice. Let's add to that. So we're going to fire the cross to the body. We're going to come up with a lead hook and another cross. So it'll be one, one. We'll show the 10. Come up with a three. And then fire, finish with a two. So one, one, 10, three, two. Good. Again, one, one, 10, three, two. Good. One, one, 10, three, two. Good. Two more. One, one, 10, three, two. One more time. One, one, 10, three, two. Yeah, nice. Good job, good job. Again, from far away. One, two, five, slip. Two, three, two. One, two, one, two. So the homework assignment. Again, one, two, five, slip. Two, three, two. One, two, one, two. Again. Good. Two more. One more time. Yeah, nice work. Good. Let's hold our opponent with our lead hand. And then we're going to fire that rear uppercut. So we're going to hand in front of your opponent. And then fire that number six. So hold them out. Hush, and fire at six. When you're pulling the hand back is when the punch comes up. So meaning you're here, and then what happens is as this hand is being pulled in, so imagine like you threw a jab and now you're pulling it back in. That's how the hand should come back in, still with good form. So holding my opponent, and as I huh, pull it in, the rear uppercut comes out. So hold my opponent, whoosh, and as it comes back in, whoosh, gets replaced by the rear uppercut. Hold him, whoosh, good. Hold him, whoosh, whoosh, that's it. Hold him. Hush. Good. Hold them. Hush. Hold them. Hush. Hold them. Hush. Good. Two more. Hold them. Hush. One more time. Hush. Yeah. Nice work. Good. From a distance, give me that nice long one too. Pa pa. Good rotation. Pa pa. Hush. Hush. Let's go one two. Let's slip to the rear side. Let's slip to the lead side. Ha! And then come back with that lead hook. So one two slip slip. Ha, and then number three. One, two, slip, slip, three. One, two, slip, slip, boosh. Nice three. One, two, slip, slip, boosh. Three, good. One, two, slip, slip, three. That's it. One, two, slip, slip, three. Uh huh. one more time. Boosh, 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 boosh. Yeah, nice work. Good work, good work, good work. Let's get some footwork in there. You guys are really good. Leslie, nice job. The rest of you guys at home, awesome stuff here. So. As you far away from the bag, depending on what kind of space you have, let's work on, actually, if you can go far, that's what I'm looking for. I actually want you to not be able to touch your bag from the distance we're starting at. So you're going to have to take a step. That's the point. So your hands are up. I want you to take a step in, but as you're stepping in, I want you to throw the jab. So notice right now I'm out of range. I'm actually going to step in to get in range to get my opponent. And now I'm going to work on pushing back with the lead foot. I'm going to fire the jab to extend me out. Notice I'm back in the range where I can't touch the bag again. That's what I'm looking for. So again, I'm in a place where I can't touch the bag. I'm going to step in to hit it and then push off that lead foot to step out. This one is really clean. This is probably the best um, example you can use if you're learning distance, especially like an amateur uh, boxer. It's getting really nice about the bounce. We watched an amateur fighter. It's a really nice bounce because mostly scoring um, is point system. It's not so much about trying to knock someone out. So you really want to be keep it clean, right? Hit and not get hit. So that's kind of the idea here. So I'm, again, I'm going to start pretty far away from the bag. I'm going to push up that back foot, whoosh, connect, and then I'm going to whoosh, connect back. So the difference with happening is I'm pushing off my back foot whoosh, to push me forward. To get back, I'm going to push off my lead foot whoosh, to step me back. This will keep my feet in the right position. So notice I'm pushing off the back, and then I'm pushing off the front. Pushing off the back, pushing on the front, and then I'm just adding a punch to it. So push off, push off. So keep doing that. So again, far away from your bag, push in, push out. That's it. One more time. Yeah, nice work. Let's do the homework assignment again. Remember that's that. One, two, five, slip, two, three, two, one, two, one, two. Good. Good. 
pa 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 again pa 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 good two more one more time pa yay nice work looking really really good you guys doing awesome stuff here let's work on some uppercuts some hooks let's get some head movement in here so let's try some new combinations so you're going to be hands up nice and high. I want you to really pretend that there's an opponent in front of you. So you're going to be here. We're going to work on this. I'm going to take my rear hand. I'm going to parry down. So as opposed to a punch coming at me here, I'm going to imagine like I'm obviously like protecting from an uppercut, someone else's uppercut. So I'm going to catch with my rear hand. And then from there, I'm going to throw my lead uppercut, right? So I'll be here. I'm going to catch my rear hand and then fire that lead uppercut. So I'll get pretty close to your bag to make it more realistic. I'm here. I'm going to catch with my rear hand and then fire with that lead uppercut. So catch, fire, catch, fire. Now imagine just like you're throwing your uppercut, imagine uppercut coming at you. The idea behind it, I'll go both cameras here. You're going to kind of cup your hand, even in a boxing glove and MMA glove too, you can still open your hand a little bit. And that's the point. So you're going to try and catch it in your palm, just like a, a baseball player catches a baseball in the, in the mitt. The kitchen in the palm. So you're gonna catch that punch in the palm and then return with your own uppercut. All right, so I'm catching and then firing with that lead uppercut. Catch, fire. Make sure you actually catch the shot. Don't just start throwing your uppercut. Think of like catching it, fire. Catch it, fire. Keep working. Catch, fire. Catch, fire. Good. Catch, fire. Keep going. Let's go two more. One more time. Yeah, nice. Let's add to that. So we're catching someone's uppercut. We're throwing on an uppercut. And then we're going to come with a rear hook just to finish it off. So I will catch. And then fire that number four. So it's catch. The number system is catch. Five. Four. So again, catch. Five. Four. Catch, catch, five, four, good. Catch, five, four, let's go two more. Catch, five, four, one more time. Catch, five, four, very good. From a distance, give me that nice long, ha, ha, one, two. Two more, ha, one more time, ha, ha, very good. Let's do like we did last time. We'll do a quick Simon Says here. Your base is going to be ones and twos. So you're continually throwing ones and twos. When I throw out, uh, call out combinations, that's what you're going to throw. And then go back to ones and twos again. So if I say one, you throw a jab. If I say two, for three or four. Let's do one, two, three, four. Let's do a five and a six as well. So it'll also be the uppercuts. And then we'll have a drop. You know, let's do, yeah, let's do a drop. Drop will be just that, just down. That's it. No slips because I'll have to specify. So again, let's go ones and twos. Just continuous. When I say one, push, you fire a solid jab, and then go back to the ones and twos. Two, push, that's a cross. Three, push, that's a lead hook. Four, push, that's a rear hook. Five, push, that's a lead uppercut. Six, push, that's a rear uppercut. And when I say drop, huh, drop down. Good. One, push. one, two. Push, push. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Five, six. Five, six. Five, six. Got it. Five, six. Five, six, three, four. 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 Good. Drop. 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 One, two. One, two, drop. 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 Five, six. Five, six. Five, six, three, four. 
Five, six, three, four. Five, six, three, four. Five, six, three, four. One, two. One, two, one, two. Woo! One, two, one, two. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Push. Five, six. Five, six. Five, six. Drop. 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 Good. Five, four, three, two. Ah. Woo! Very nice. Woo. Feel it on my shoulders. Let's go right into our shoe shine punches. Remember, that's to give your shoulders a break. Think of circular motion here. Use your legs, use your butt, use your back. Don't use your shoulders. Give your shoulders a break. So, just kind of taking my time here. A little recovery. Good. Three, two, one. Very nice. Looking really, really good. Let's shoot that jab. Let's shoot that lead uppercut. I really love this one. Just a nice, clean one, five. So, the number one. And number five, again, from a distance. So I'm reaching for the bag, reaching for the bag. Five, six. I mean, sorry, one, one, five. One, five. Nice and long. If you get a good rhythm on your bag, you can make it continuous. That's it. Let's add the two to that. One, five, two. Good. Ba, ba, ba. Ba, ba, ba. Let's go for two more. One more time. Nice work. Looking really, really good. Why is looking sharp here? Let's get to that. So one, five, two, three, two. So one, five, two, three, two. Let's go for two more. One more time. Yay, nice work. Let's just shoot a nice long ush, cross. Give me good, huh, good hip rotation. Make sure that punch is turning over. Keep it clean. So I'm far away from my bag. Ush, good rotation. Ush, that's what I'm looking for. Ush, ush, good. Ush, 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 ush. So now it's going for that two and I'm going for that five, two, five. I'm trying to hit that nice and clean. Good. Let's go for two more. One more time. Very good. From a distance, let's go for that five, six, five, six. Five, six, five, six. Let's bounce on the toes. Let's finish with some explosive punches here. So from a distance, five, six, five, six. And then boom, boom, a hard one, two, again, from a distance. So I want to, and then ha, ha, and really shoot those last two hard. So ha, ha, that's it. Ha, ha. Ha, ha. Good. Five, six, one, two. Ha, ha. Let's go for two more. Ha, ha. One more time. Ha, good. Again, shoot that. Push hard cross. Push. Push. Two more. Push. One more time. Good. Switch your stance. Hard cross again. Push. Really good. Good pivot. Push. 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 That's it. Push. Push. Two more. Push. One more time. Push. Good. Back to your regular stance again. Let's go one, two, one, two. Ha ha. And then a three, four. One, two, one, two, three, four. Stay bouncing on those toes. Hush, hush. Three, four, hit as hard as you can. So let's go for a quick one, two, one, two. And then a hard three, four. One, two, one, two. Boom, boom. One, two, one, two. Ha, ha. Again. Ha, ha. Ha, ha. Yes. Ha, ha. Ha, ha. Yeah. Ha, ha. Three more. Ha, ha. Two more. One more time. Ha ha. Whew. And that is time. Whew. Nice work, everybody. That was a 30 minute workout. I hope you guys enjoyed it. So remember the homework assignment for today, for tonight, is the one, two, five, slip to the rear side, 
two, three, two, one, two, one, two. Thank you for tuning in and I will catch you next time.